hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel today i'm going to be showing you how to make akara also known as beans ball using the ayola beans flour this is stress-free there's no time for you to bring out your beans pick wash or even blend now let's get right into it in a blender transfer your pepper shombo onions garlic you can actually omit garlic if you want to, but if you're like me, use garlic. It makes the taste different. I just added a little water to aid blending. I'm going to blend this for 20 to 30 seconds. As soon as you're done blending your peppers, go ahead and measure 3 cups of the Ayola beans flour. You can use whatever flour you have in handy, but in my case, I'm using Ayola because it's just too perfect for me. Make a well in center and throw in the blended pepper mix. Stir all together to combine. At this point, you need to add little water until you have achieved that consistency you need. At this point, Stirring the akara butter will actually help reduce and get rid of lumps. If you discover that the akara butter is still thick, go ahead and add little water. But be careful not to add too much water because you wouldn't want to have a running batter. some salt and chopped onions for more crunchiness stir to combine after you're done with mixing this is exactly how your butter should look like now let's fry use a soup spoon and throw in butter into a heated oil Remember to fry in a low heat. Be careful not to overcrowd your pan else it will soak up with too much oil and you wouldn't want that. Allow this to fry for 2 to 3 minutes. Then flip to the other side so that it could fry as well. After you're done frying, remove from heat immediately to avoid browning further. guys your akara is ready to be devoured you can actually have this with pap tea whatever you want to use okay thank you so much for watching i know you've learned something from this don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel see you all next time i love you bye bye